And don't you budge out of this cave, or you'll get the beating of your life, understand? Yes, stepmother. Let me hear positive thinking. I will find a husband. I will be a bride. I will find a husband. I will be a bride. Oh, dear friend, I know now I'll never go to the festival. All your dreams will come true. You must go. I will take you. That's the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Who is she? I don't know. I'll ask her. How can you ignore this fine example of, of, of... They're the prize winner. She'll get the handsomest, richest husband. She'll make her mother a very happy woman. Why can't you look like that? Because I was born to you. Ow! Hmm, she looks familiar to me. She is familiar, like a queen, a princess. Must be a member of the royal family. Look at her gold slippers. They're priceless. Where have you come from? From a place so distant it could be right under your nose. May I ask your name? It is the same as that of a long-departed ancestor. May I know the name of that honored ancestor? You would have to ask her. <laughs> <laughs> may I presume that you are an unmarried person? You may presume that, but the day is young. You are the most beautiful creature on Earth. Perhaps if you were to dance with me, we might help the day age gracefully. She's probably got nothing to do all day but take dancing lessons and be waited on by servants. I hate to say this. Doesn't she bear the smallest resemblance to our own Ye Shen? Preposterous. Hm. But I do see the resemblance. Let me take a closer look. Now what? Close your eyes and don't open them until I tell you. your eyes on this. Where is she? Gone. Something is strange. Could you look after my precious unmarried daughter till I return? The other slipper. I must the other slipper. I've lost it. I've lost it. Gold Eyes, tell me, please, where is the other slipper? Oh, Gold Eyes, now I've lost you. Yeah, Shen, what are you doing here? You're supposed to be working back at the cave. I, I just wanted to see the festival from a distance. You've seen enough. Go home now. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Most splendid. Most unusual. Is there a mate to this? I searched the forest, but did not find another. 
I'll buy it. It'll be a gift to a lady, to a king. Oh, you're great and wise for your years, Highness. I bring a most remarkable gift, the likes of which have never been seen. Thank you, loyal merchant. It is truly remarkable. Who made this slipper? I do not know, Excellency. It was found in the forest. This slipper is so marvelous, I am convinced it was made for a woman of great beauty and wealth. I will find this woman. Next! I've searched everywhere, but I can't find it. Please tell me what to do. Yeah, Shen! Who are you talking to? No one, stepmother. I've always known something was wrong with you. Go to sleep. I want you to scrub this cave spotless in the morning. Excuse me, I'm looking for a golden slipper. Do you know if anyone has found such a thing? Everyone wants the golden slipper. He found it. Excuse me, I'm told you found a golden slipper. Yes, I did, in the forest. May I see it? I sold it to the merchant. Sir, I am told you have a golden slipper. Yes, a most beautiful item. What is your interest in it? May I buy it from you? <laughs> That's not only funny, but impossible. You see, I gave it as a gift to the king. Then I must acquire it from the king. <laughs> The king is so entranced by it, he'll never give it up. In fact, he'd give anything to find the young woman whose foot fits it. All females in the kingdom are flocking to the palace to try it on. Why not join them? Thank you, sir. I shall. Look at this one in rags. Shall I throw her out, Captain? No, the sight of her trying on the slipper might amuse the king. Yes, that's it. Your Highness, I recognize that slipper. To whom does it belong? To the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. Tell me her name. I don't know it. She ran off before I could find out. But she captured my heart. I've only seen her slipper, but she captured my heart, too. Where did you see her? at the village festival. I thought she was clearly of royal lineage. Then we must go there. Captain, no more try-ons. Come with me. That's all. You may leave. Stop! Get her! No, no. The slipper belongs to my friend. I have to return it to him. To him? Am I to believe a man has a foot so tiny and dainty? My friend is a fish. Your friend is a fish? Then your fish has a crazy friend. Throw her into a dungeon. No, no, you must listen to me. A girl in rags tried to steal the slipper. Said the slipper belonged to her fish. I had her thrown in a dungeon. Hmm, the slipper design is very much like the scales of a fish. Poor girl. Have her released in the morning. By order of the king, you are freed. Get out and stay away from the golden slipper. My people, this beautiful and valuable slipper has been lost by someone. Will the owner please come forward? Your Supreme Highness, my daughter lost her slipper at this very place on her way home from a lute lesson. Put your foot in it, honey. <laughs> it always was a little snug. Next. I'm next. No, you're not. But, uh... Out! I believe we might have frightened off the rightful owner by our presence. Let's leave the slipper here, hide nearby, and see what happens. But 
That's the same girl who tried to steal it yesterday. I'll have her thrown into prison forever. No, wait. She's stealing it. Now I'll get her. No! Perhaps she's taking it for her mistress. Let's just follow her, see what she does. Yes, Your Highness. She will be surrounded at all times.